How can you estimate differences? Think about this question during the lesson. All of the tickets for a concert were sold. So far, 126 people have arrived at the concert. About how many people who have tickets have not arrived? What information in the problem tells you that you can estimate? Since you need to find about how many, you can estimate. How does an estimate compare to the actual answer? An estimate is close to the exact answer. Estimate 493 minus 126 by rounding. You can round each number to the nearest hundred. Let's review how to round numbers. What are the steps for rounding numbers? Find the digit in the rounding place. Look at the next digit to the right. How does that digit help you in rounding? And what will 493 round to? If the next digit is 5 or greater, increase the digit in the rounding place by 1. Change all the digits to the right of the rounding place to zeros. If the digit to the right of the rounding place is less than 5, leave the digit in the rounding place alone. Change all the digits to the right of the rounding place to zeros. About 400 people have not yet arrived. Another way to solve this problem is to round each number to the nearest 10. Find the digit in each rounding place. About 360 people have not yet arrived. Why are the estimates different? For one estimate, each number is rounded to the nearest 100. For the other estimate, each number is rounded to the nearest 10. Which estimate do you think is closer to the actual difference? The one that is rounded to the nearest 10 is closer because the estimates used are closer to the original numbers. Now you know how to estimate differences by rounding whole numbers to the hundreds or tens place.